Destined in its full insertion. Um, I'm April Lynn Pike, and I wrote Destined, which is the final book of the Wings series. My name is Dan Wells, and my book is called Partials. I'm Esther Kincaid, and my book is called Insignia. Um, my favorite thing is going on the bird tours because we get to have this co worker camaraderie, um, which we don't usually get to have as writers. My least favorite thing is early wake up times. <laughs> the hotel food definitely depends on the hotel. The hotel we're at here has a restaurant. Yes. Um, I, I like the food when I go on tour. But really, you know, like Brian said, the best part is getting to meet other authors, and especially when you, you kind of click and have fun. And we have been having lots of fun. And yeah, getting up early or missing sleep, and yeah. <laughs> yeah, again, uh, my favorite part uh, of touring, of any kind of tour, is a group tour like this where we get to hang out with other authors and get to know them and, and uh, we all have the same kinds of stories that we tell each other, which is fun. Um, and my least favorite part, I just had surgery two weeks ago, I had my tailbone removed, and now <laughs> I have been on six airplanes in six days, oh, that's a lot of sitting down, and I'm ready to kill everyone. Um, just like everyone else, uh, my favorite part is just really being around the other authors and like learning everything that, you know, they already know. <laughs> so that's great. Um, my least favorite part is flying on airplanes every single day. <laughs> I hate flying, so. Um, well, I'll start because I'm, I uh, have finished my series with this book, which is really exciting. Um, it, it, it feels like you have like this big accomplishment under your, under your belt. Oh, the whole series, woohoo! Um, Although, I feel like I know a lot more than I did when I was a debut, and I'm like, oh, I know what to expect, and, uh, you know, I kind of know things that are going to happen, and, and everything's really, it still has a lot of the same excitement without all of this kind of, and what next? Um, but it, it, it's also really kind of exciting and scary to start on something new next year, and, and that makes me feel like a debut again. I'm like, and I'm going to do it again. <laughs> and I'm sort of on the verge of finishing, I guess next year will be the end of my series, so I feel like very in the middle, not sure um, how things are going to go, how it's going to end, <laughs> what's going to happen next year, so it's all very exciting, um, but you know, it takes a lot of adjusting, so I feel like I just adjusted, but I have to adjust more. Having a lot of books out um, it has made this year crazy. I actually have two out new this year from different publishers. I do science fiction with Harper and thrillers with Tor. And so I'm kind of touring with both books right now, with two different publishers, and for three solid weeks, which is awesome, and I never imagined I would be in this position, and now that I'm here, I'm like, this is being organized, and, and know where I'm supposed to be and why, it's nuts, but it's a lot of fun. And what time it is. Yeah, yeah. I have no idea. I, I went to a signing two hours early yesterday because I got lost in time zones, so. Let's see, I don't know, this is my first book, so uh, I, my debut was yesterday, so, you know, most people... You know, haven't haven't really heard of it before, so you know it's kind of it's kind of cool. Just like it's kind of like a glimpse ahead, just to see like what it will be like down the road, really. And um, you know, I've met some people who are just uh, fantastic. So yeah. <laughs>